Hello there, welcome to the Boz TV. The development of electric trains in Africa faces several challenges including funding and the need for adequate maintenance. However, the potential benefits of electric transport such as reduced emissions and faster travel times make it an attractive option for many nations. As interest in electric trains grows across the continent, several nations are beginning to implement strategies for expansion. This trend raises key questions about the future of transport in Africa and its impact on economic growth and sustainability. Currently, there are eight African countries that operate electric train systems. Each nation has invested in electrified rail networks for various reasons including economic efficiency, environmental sustainability and improved transport systems. So in this video we will see 8 African countries with electric train systems. The first country is Nigeria. Nigerian electric train is called the Blue Line. The Blue Line is an electric rapid transit line that runs in Lagos, Nigeria. It is part of Lagos Rail Mass Transit System run by Lagos Metropolitan Area Transport Authority. The first phase with five stations and 13 kilometers of track opened on 4 September 2023. The full line is said to be 27 kilometers and is expected to carry 500,000 passengers a day. The line's trains are made by CRRC Dalian and based on Chinese Type B trains from Tianjin Metro Line 2. They have a maximum speed of 100 km an hour, although they only operate at 80 km an hour. The second country is South Africa. South Africa operates a modern electric train system with recent upgrades focused on urban mobility and safety. South Africa has long been a leader in rail electrification on the continent and recent development show continued investment in electric train infrastructure. South Africa began electrifying its railways in the early 20th century. The country's rail network includes both long-distance and urban commuter lines powered by electricity. The Passenger Rail Agency of South Africa, PRASA, has introduced a new electric multiple units EMUs on Cape Town's central lines. These modern trains are part of the People Trains initiative aimed to improve safety, affordability and efficiency. Number 3 is Ethiopia. Ethiopia operates two major electric train systems, the Addis Ababa Light Rail and the Addis Ababa Djibouti Railway, both powered by an overhead electric lines and built with Chinese support. The Addis Ababa Light Rail Transit was launched in 2015, 34 km total and split into two lines, the north-south line 16.6 km from Menelik 2 Square to Kaliti and east-west line 17.4 km from Ayat to Tu Halioch Hospital. The Addis Ababa Djibouti Standard Gate Railway was launched in 2018. The length is 752 km with 656 km in Ethiopia. The line is fully electrified using overhead lines. The speed is up to 120 km an hour for passenger trains. The purpose of this railway was to facilitate freight and passenger movement between Ethiopia and Djibouti, crucial for Ethiopia's access to the sea. Number 4 is Tanzania. Tanzania officially launched its first electric train in 2024, connecting Dar es Salaam to Dodoma via Standard Gate Railway. It is the fastest and most modern rail system in East Africa. The route is from Dar es Salaam to Dodoma, spanning 440 kilometers of high-speed electric track. Trains reach speeds of up to 160 kilometers an hour, cutting travel time to under four hours. Operations began in August 2024, following the test run in April. The operator of this railway is Tanzania Railway Corporation, TRC. 
This is one of Africa's very few fully electric intercity rail systems. Number five is Egypt. Egypt is developing an extensive electric train network, including high-speed rail lines aimed at improving transportation for both passengers and goods across the country. Egypt is currently undertaking significant projects to establish high-speed electric trains, which will consist of multiple lines connecting various cities and regions. The total length of the planned network is approximately 2,000 kilometers. Number 6 is Morocco. Morocco operates Africa's first high-speed electric train, Alborac, and powers 90% of its national rail fleet with renewable energy. The Alborac was launched in 2018 from Tangier to Casablanca, spanning 323 kilometers. The speed of Alborac is 320 kilometers an hour, though typically operates between 160 to 200 kilometers an hour. Built with support from Alstom and SNCF using French TGV technology, it cuts travel time between Tangier and Casablanca from 5 hours to just 2 hours. Number 7 is Tunisia. Tunisia operates several electric train lines including the Sahel Metro and the Rapid Railway Network in Greater Tunis with ongoing upgrades to expand urban mobility. The Sahel Metro connects Sose, Monastir and Mahdia along the eastern coast. The length is 65 kilometers and it uses narrow gauge 1000 millimeters. The line is powered by overhead electric lines and saves coastal commuters and tourists, linking key cities and resorts. The TGM line Tunis Gulit Massa runs from central Tunis to La Massa via La Gulit. The length is 19 kilometers and it is powered by overhead electric system. Tunisia Total Rail Network spans 2,170 kilometers with 65 kilometers electrified in the Sahel and 25 kilometers electrified in the Greater Tunis. Number 8 is Algeria. Algeria operates electric trains on several major routes and is expanding its electrified rail network with new high-speed electric train sets planned by 2035. Algeria began electrifying its railway in the 1980s, focusing on key intercity corridors in the north. The National Rail Company manages over 200 stations and a network concentrated in the northern region. The electrified routes include Algiers to Oran, Algiers to Constantine, and Algiers to Anaba. These lines use overhead electric systems. So, there you have it eight African countries with electrified railway systems. If you are new to this channel, be sure to like, share and subscribe to The Boss TV. Thank you for watching and see you next time my friend. Until then, as always, bye bye.